There he is. There he is. Okay, is it working? It's a working. It's a working meow. It is. It's World of Warships time. A little after hour stream. Hope everybody is having a wonderful day, night, wherever you are. We're just gonna um, do some casual play here and have a good time. Anybody that would like to join in, just chime in and we'll rotate you in and out or in or in and out, just depending on uh, how it goes here. So back and enjoy the stream here, guys. Let me pull YouTube back in. Um, I was going to make... Is. Literally made it just for Pulse Wave, the, the, the outfit. But now I'm building a beam overload build on a Keldon Cruiser. All right, Lurch, what do you want to run? Nice cruiser. You want to do that operation, or you want to wait for Nick later, or? Is yeah, Nick, Nick you... coming, or is he like focused on? Oh, he's working on his tank stuff right now, I think. In Star oh, Trek sorry, Online. Nick, I know you're still here. I'm just not treating you the way you treated me the other day. <laughs> Talking sorry. about me like I'm not even don't even exist. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, no, okay. I, I've got food in a minute. Oh, so, okay. What kind of food? I got some taquitos. I need to go grab some of them. Pizza. Starving. Ooh, that sounds good. I love pizza. Is it an extra yeah, we, small? We run the operation. It is an extra small. <laughs> I just remember whatever Solar was talking about the other night. <laughs> we could run it is the a opera. mighty fine extra small. Um. You just got a warning before you could chat. <laughs> what did the warning say? Uh, I, I forget now. It was one of those you know, when you go to a new channel. Oh yeah. Warning before you post here. It's like be nice, no politics. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm a little shocked right, it gave but... me that warning. I mean, how long have I been part of your channel? <laughs> yeah. <I don't... laughs> It's like it's a new game. We just got to make sure, like, they understand. Uh, you said it's tier six for the operation. Yeah, yeah. Uh, what about uh? Shit, I forget his name now. Nick. Intrigue. <laughs> no, not Nick. Uh, Intrigue doesn't have the game yet. Uh, oh, I, and oh, Intrigue, you are downloading. Okay. And whether you're in or not, you're more than welcome to just hang out, regardless. Just. So we're clear on that. Uh, once you get the game, you will have to do, I don't know, quite a few, like, um, basically TFOs. Um, and as you do so many, like, runs, you'll you'll unlock more access to the game. So, like, the armory and doing randoms and things like that. So once you kind of burn through that, I think you have to get to, like, once you get to, like, level 9 or 10... Uh, which is pretty easy. I think there's like four or five in between each level. Um, it might even be less than that. Uh, that'll be enough to be able to like get in and, and we can play with you even right away. Um, we can just go down to lower tiers with you and stuff to help you burn through it. So, Yeah, I, I, I got through about tier uh, one through three, four with uh, Lurch. And this dude turned up and was like, let's go through t eights and nines. I'm like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's all, it's all good. Once you get up into like your your eights and stuff, then you can you can make a little bit more money. So like I'm a little biased, I'll I'll go there. But right now there's no major events going except for the uh, dockyard, and we'll just see how that goes. So I'm I'm down for whatever. Is damn near tier blind. I think even <laughs> under tier six, like, I don't want to do it. No, I'll do I it. Think I can even like even I'll say like if if you want to play that game. Like if you put in like a few days of like really hard grinding, you'd probably earn a hell of a lot more than I have in like a couple of weeks. Dude, I I made an EU account, right? And and I uh, you know I'd already been through all the beginning missions, blah blah blah. So I was able to get to where I wanted to be, which was having the armory unlocked, which I want to say was like level nine or ten, I don't know. And so what I did is I just went into co-ops and I just rammed a ship, and then I left. Since I was dead, got another ship and rammed it, that ship. And I think it took me like an hour and 45 minutes to get to where I wanted to be at. <laughs> which was basically all the basic. Because everything after that is like being able to do like ranked battles or having like a flag on your ship. Which, you know, for a new player, rank doesn't fucking matter. Flag on your ship doesn't do anything. It just lets you uh, have a flag on your ship. You know, because they're not, not the uh, flags that give you boost, but just like the different special flags you can get there just for looks basically 
So a lot of the shit at the top tier wasn't really a big deal at all. Uh, Alright, tier I'll six we said. Okay. I want a piece of pizza. Uh, what's this operation like? It's Raptor Rescue. It's the one where you escort the uh, carrier. Okay. The first okay. one you tried. The one that you got nuked. Yeah. Like, the tin. I don't want any of the American battleships because they're so goddamn slow. So you, so you don't bring a destroyer this time. <laughs> All right. Uh, bring this guy. These ones, I feel like I need to be in a battleship. Because you have well, to go places because you're, you're yeah, escorting them. Yeah, but if you're them. a battleship, don't bring... I, I, I don't know if, about the American line. It brings something slow. that could actually keep pace. Yeah, they're too slow. And cruisers, it's like, it's hard to kind of kite because it's like, what... You know, you can't just go anywhere. You have to stay with who you're fucking escorting. You know, I'm going to take the war spite. That's what I do. That's just a solid ship all the way around. No, the London's not. Spite. There we go. Oh, that's cool. So you can do quite a few people in um, doing those... Uh, the operations you can do more than three seven yeah then you could keep it as a Two, three, pick up allies four, there's five, a little box at the bottom that'll seven take oh, okay in. that's cool oh if anyone else wants in just say something always looking for new friends but the whole pickup allies that's more for if you actually open up the uh the menu you can pick any operation you want at any week just have to have enough oh, okay. people to play it. The cat got food, right? Does the cat have food? Why the fuck are you asking me that? Go give him food. I'm not sure. I'm playing video games. Why don't you go and check for me? You better not be talking to the missus. No, I'm talking to my kid. He's always really concerned about the cat. I feed the cats when I go to bed every night, regardless. And, uh, but my, my oldest son, he's always like really concerned, you know, cause if they're making noise, I'm just always thinking. So he always texts me, the cat's got food. I'm like, I don't fucking know, man. Like you're right there. You know, go, go check. <laughs> you know? That's right. I mean, it's good. He cares. You're waiting on me to ready up. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Fine. Are you see, is he giving me lip? All right. All right, we are launching. Here we go. He has entered the rebellious stage. He's uh he's actually he's a really good kid. Actually, I think all your kids are. Yeah. They're all well, well behaved. Yeah, Roman's he's he's really good. Now your wife on the other hand. <laughs> yeah. They get it from me. <laughs> like my middle boy Riker, he um He's a little more emotional. He'll kind of lie to me sometimes, and I can see it all over his face. That's a big problem for me. And then my youngest, he's, like, really fucking smart. He spent a lot of time with me when he was younger. I'd take him to work with me and stuff because my wife would be taking care of the other two, getting them to school, all that kind of thing. And so he's, like, an ex like he's that one he's going to, like, call you out and bust your balls and all that kind of stuff, and in a pretty witty way, you know, where it's, like, it makes me mad, but I'm also kind of proud of it, you know? They're all they're all a little different, but my oldest, he's he's the one like he'll take action. You know, one of the brothers is fallen in the pool. He's going to jump in and grab him. You know, my middle one, though, he's more of a I'll freeze up kind of a guy. Take the role of the big brother. Good. Yeah. But my middle one, like if you're messing with like his younger brother and he gets angry, he will unleash holy hell on people, you know. And sometimes I'm like, ah, it's a little too much. But at the end of the day, I mean, if you're messing with, you know, his brother and I'm not around, then, you know, that's just what you had coming to you. So, you 
know, we'll, we'll figure out, at, we'll figure it out after. And we've had the talk too, you know, sometimes like, sometimes you might have to do the right thing, but you're going to get in trouble for doing the right thing. And that's just the consequence and that's okay. You know, <laughs> someone's messing with your, your brother at school, you know, and it's bad enough and you have to intervene in some kind of way and you get in trouble. Well, you're going to be in trouble, but it was still the right thing to do. You know, I might even have to punish you for it, but. Sometimes doing the right thing, uh, you have consequences for that. Let's make sure my, my beer isn't in my, how was it before? It was like my head was on top of it. All right, so we're escorting them out of here. Is this one where they do the repair ship? Yep, yep. Okay. That always hangs around the carrier. Yep. Game music is really loud. I'm like almost zero. I can barely hear it. The Kim battle. Why is it every time before, right before I have to fire? Yeah. Enemy sighted. Oh, a little too much leading. I don't have hydro on this thing, so I know he's got torps in the water. So if you're over here, be, be aware. Damn, you got blasted. Citadel. About time. Yeah. Hey, you're still alive. Woo! Still alive. I haven't even got hit yet. We're doing good. Yeah, I'm the one that's been getting nailed. You're out there on the edge. You can get back in here. Oh, let's see. Oh, another cruiser coming in. He's way out there, too. Quite reach him. Should be two of them over there. Yep, there's another one. He's still a good ways out, too. He's out of my firing range. I'm really I happy with go. this. Sorry, go ahead. No. Uh, I was just saying, I gotta go to south to intercept that carrier. Oh, okay. Really happy really with happy the uh, water, the water mod. It looks really oh, yeah. good. Is that two more? Or are those the same ones? They're like going around the flank us from the back. No, now there's three up there. The other one just popped up, so there's okay. a total of three. Gotcha. Oh. I have my wrong camera frame on. So why'd you give up on the green screen? Um, this one is just easier. Um, the green screen takes a little more uh, G uh, CPU and transcoding. This one, like, when I'm done with it, I can just fold it up over and, like, fold it all up and just put it away. It's just easier. Um, I could hang the green screen from it, and I thought about that as, 
as well. But, um, and I, I got a new camera too, so it can probably be better as well. But it just, with the old camera I had with the green screen, everything was just like, like it all looked fine, but it just was all kind of subpar y to me. Right. Then I also found like, you know, trying to find like the right background. It was just, I don't know, it was just all too much. Just do the, uh, Let's do the fucking brick wall and I have to worry about it, you know. That was a huge swing and a miss by me. Who the hell's that damn destroyer? Six seconds. Ooh, double Citadel. So I played a game last night in ranked with no captain on my ship. So there was some streamer I was watching. I can't remember his name, but uh, he was doing some tests with and without. And he felt like at max range, specifically on battleships, that it was almost like it was like nerfing you. And then you put your commander in and pick skills and then it would like unnerf you. So... He ran it with no commander and did really well, especially at farther ranges with his battleship. So I went into a ranked battle with no commander. My first volley, I got a triple citadel on a ship. Really? Yeah, wow. triple citadel with no no commander. But the problem with that is it's all RNG, so who's to say you just didn't get lucky? That's true. And I mean, what I did is not a scientific test or anything by any means, I agree. Um, and there are some benefits, right, to having a commander like I know if I'm being targeted and my detection range and things like that, you know. So uh, it wasn't like, you know, oh, let's all just not use commanders. That doesn't make sense. But it seems like and obviously, regardless of a change this big, you know, there, there's going to be fixes they need to make. So there's right. definitely something weird happening. But this guy that I was watching, he ran like three or four games and then he ran some with and it was kind of back and forth, you know, like he performed good on all of them and he's a pretty good player. But the amount of Citadel difference and dispersion you could visually see when you fire your shells, there was a noticeable difference. Wasted my shots. Ooh, New Mexico. There's got to be another DD closer. There's no way he shot those that far away, a bot, and hit him. Oh, well, there's a DD right behind the island. To your, what, at 1 o'clock for you? Yeah, yeah, no, I see him. Okay, there's the other one. I was oh. like, there's got to be another one. I'm still trying to get back into the range. You guys get the carrier already? Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, the, uh, the other guy got it. Seems like he did all the work. Just tagging along. Tell I took aim on something, he nuked it, so... Oh, well. What are these? Where's the other DD oh, sitting in the smoke? Dallas handled that. So we got a battleship sitting over here. turns as soon as I shoot. It's <laughs> nice. Murphy's Law. I might actually take last place this match. The ship is on fire. Oh well. Oh, 
Uh, where's the end destination of where they're going? See the anchor down in uh, J1? Oh, okay. I1? Yep. So I don't want to go too far off after these guys. Yeah, it pops up in three different locations, and it, it's determined, it progressively sets course in a general direction that it just give you the exit point. Gotcha. Okay. So it's not like you can't tell ahead of time where he's going, it's just, yeah. you gotta take advantage of it. Got another carrier. For that, I need to get turrets turning. Come on, Mia. We got two cruisers pulling guard duty. Yay. Cruisers, you know, the Dallas is here. Now, let's see if we could get that uh, bonus just outside the map. There's usually two islands next to each other, and this right here actually has a test target that goes from island to island in between one of the sets. Okay. It spawns, and if you hit it, it's actually an extra achievement. You have to hit it with torpedoes, not guns. Motherfucker. Kind of sucks. But... Ooh, what do we have down here? We got that. Like a DD uh, down there? A uh, cruiser just came in. Oh, okay, I see it. Try to try and catch up. I want to hit this carrier. Uh, over the island. Uh, another cruiser just showed up. The Citadel. But I'm talking. He put my beer in front of my camera. Yep, test targets up. And where'd you say that was? Uh, uh, I1J1, just outside the border, right next to the map. There's two islands. I1J1. I'm too far out for it even I'm to be visible. I'm more worried about the two battleships and the cruiser down here right now. Worry okay. about that. So. I'm hauling ass that get way. It, get it, but I'm not worried about it. I got hung up, taking the guys out in the back there. I did shoot a volley of torps at it, see what the hell happens. Probably not gonna hit. Battleships. I have torps, but it's only two per side. Trying to get in. I'm I'm in like the middle of the map. Spotter planes. Fuck. Still doesn't get me there. Change course here. You're in a pretty bad spot there. Oh. Okay, 12 seconds.
Yes. Swing and a miss. I missed the target outside. Couple torps on it. It's down. No thanks to me. Another cruiser in front of me in my range. I'm going to engage that. Shit, I think I just killed myself. Yeah, I think I did. Ramming? Ramming speed! It wasn't intentional, but I didn't plan on him turning this way. I'm trying to turn out of it right now. Oh, God. Thank God. The test targets are up. The two islands just outside the border of the map, right behind our exit point. It is going back and forth right there. Okay. I'll it just look for it a little bit per cycle. You have okay. to hit it with corpse, not. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. So I'm hoping these guys, these guys have torps they actually do it. I think our best bet's the carrier. No, it's not. Best chance is Nick. <laughs> From the future. Exact dreamer. I was just had a th not, not a thought, but like with the KDF ships going to bed, cross factional um, might be what to do with the tank. But I don't know, some of those KDF ships are big and bulky, and I don't know, mate, I might do that. Oh, wait, this guy going in a fucking ram? He might. It's an easy, fast kill. Uh, so that's on the bot. I mean, they do that a lot, which really irritates yeah. the shit out of me. Hey, you see that little ship? I don't know if you can see it, Stu. I see the two islands. There's a little ship one right between both of them right now. I do not see. Oh, yeah, yeah, I see it. It's like a little white, weird looking ship. It's yeah, like I hit the torpedoes for a special achievement. Oh, okay. That's kind of cool. I didn't I didn't know about that. It's kind of weird looking funky. Yeah, it doesn't funky. show up all the time. It's only a, a random spawn. Oh, okay. I just got an alert saying drops are available on... MC Stu, link your account to... How the hell did we fail? ...to be eligible for in-game items. What? Yeah, so... So by just watching any stream that has the drops enabled, you can get uh, Twitch box drops. Um, I think you can get like four or five per patch. So if you haven't gotten any, just leave it up in the background and you'll get some boxes. Uh, so link my Twitch to my... Your Wargaming account? Yeah. Yeah, it's the one. Yep. If you go okay. to your uh, account settings, it should have an option. Yeah, five citadels on that run. Um, oh, it's Twitch. I was thinking, I'm looking for a wargaming game. Like, you want to do it, it? You do it from your Twitch or from your wargaming account. Yeah, uh, I got an, the uh, the uh, email for the code, so it's like, where's okay. the code? Oh. Yeah, well, all you have to do if you go to log into uh, Wargaming, click on the um, uh, top right uh, username, and then drop down, it'll uh, say like account settings. You'll click on that and it'll be right there. And you'll just click on Twitch. If you're logged into Twitch, it'll ask you if you want to connect. You do that and you're good. Yep, got Twitch. I don't really think I want anything else. Save it, cause sometimes they're, sometimes they're like they'll give you shit like, hey, link your account to YouTube and you'll get, you know, a bundle of flags. Like, wait for them to do that. So we got our combat yeah, missions. Yeah, like I just got uh, like one for your stream, like. You know. So I just did do it, did uh, Twitch then. But... So only I didn't get any between the last patch, and I haven't gotten any yet. So. I know that. Uh, there's there are some bugs that develop like if you go to your wargame account unlink and relink and then that'll take care of that if you're not seeing any come in 
So I end up maxing out the drops I can get within like a couple days of a patch happening. So you joining us, Nick? I need to run Borg before I do. Or I'll forget to do it. Uh, Borg ground. I need another, let's see, main battery ribbons. Uh, potential damage cruiser. I'm getting close. I'm so behind on this shit. Uh, how about a tier 7 co op match? Uh, sure. That's not right. I only have T6. You're not in not yet. In <laughs> <laughs> you don't get a boat. Ah, yeah, I'm, I am the boat. Good thing is, I already re equipped all my mods to the. You know the ships I'm keeping. My preferred ship. Okay. I sold off the excess. They gave me enough to buy like two or three ships. So I'm buying Where back ships that I have ammo for that I got rid of. Gotcha. So the other thing I need to do my commanders on is my Japanese and my English. I think I did some of the English, but. Holy, you're uh, up to what seven thousand channel points? I right? like. 4,000 or 5,000 earlier in the day. You're talking about me? Let's do stream. Uh, I don't have a use for them. So they just sit there and collect. How many do you have? 7.3. Oh, I was going to say probably a lot more than me, but that's not a lot more than me. No, I don't watch do all the time. <laughs> my, my wife has 9.9k. I have her account up because I use it for drops for my EU account. Sneaky. Yep. For some reason, whenever I do co-op with this ship, it's always this map. I, I've, always, I've always noticed something. Is it? Is your vape got like a ring to it or that's just your wedding ring that's like a black one? Uh, I mean, I, I have two, and then I guess it's kind of hard to see. I got a white gold one or something, and then I have this other one. It actually yeah. glows in the dark. Let me see if I can light Is it. Is that, like, <laughs> anything significant, or it's just a ring you like? Uh, it's just, like, the this one, I just moved up onto my knuckle. That's the one I got when I got married. And then my wife got me this uh, other one for, me. like, I don't know, my... Anniversary or something, so I put it on. I've never taken either one of them off, so. One that glows yeah. in the dark. That's so she could identify your ass at yeah. night. <laughs> yeah. Is that you? <laughs> Is it like work well? Like you, you can be walking around and like you just see a little band. Um. What do you mean? Does it work well? Like I haven't, I haven't like lost really a finger or anything, but. <laughs> Is it really reflective? It's not reflective. It's some kind of like a like resin material. And so like right now you can't tell, but like if I go out in the sun, then I go somewhere where it's even a little bit dark. It it the whole thing doesn't glow. There's like little veins all through it and they light up like big time. It it's kind of cool. Yeah. He's got a mood ring. Yeah, that's what it is. It's off oh, I, right I now, was, so I, I noticed it like um some a lot of guys have like black rings for their wedding rings. I had a, initially got two because so my wife had got me this one. It's um, it's not is this one? Yeah, this one's white gold with two little diamonds. I'm like, I don't want the diamonds. I want, you know, like one of just the big um, what was it like titanium ones, you know, and that fucking thing was so uncomfortable. And this one, like, it's a little more like. I don't know. I don't want the diamonds. I want something manly. Something right. to open up beer bottles. Yeah, and it was fucking uncomfortable. So, like, day one, like, I just put the other one on and I just never took it off. DD to my right. You're like a mile ahead of me. What the hell? What? what You're in a battleship. Huh? What country is that? This one is American, I believe. Yeah. Premium? Yeah. 
This is the Atlanta. This thing's like got fucking machine guns and just shoots. Yeah, that's what I was noticing. I'm like, hey, that's like the ship I want to fly. Yeah, it's got uh, like it's got a lot of guns and a real fast reload. I need main battery hits. That's why I'm running this one right now. It's like if I get into a good spot where I'm just like lined up on something, you can just get like one after another. Yeah, it's kind of like the Evelina. It's got a yeah, very fast fire rate, a lot of cannons. Yeah, like, that's like four and a bit seconds. I need to do Borg, but it's not freaking popping. It's it, it's infected medicine into the hive. Where's the Borg ground battle zone? I forget. Uh, it's uh north of Deep Space Nine. Uh, Fuck, I'm almost five. dead. I need to move, 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 move. What's your why? What's up? What's your why? My why? Yeah. Why? <laughs> I don't know what you mean. Your, your, your why is like a like a sonar. My why. You get your T and your why. You get the T will look like uh, planes. Or oh, uh, that was radar, I believe. Thought we've been over this, Nick. You got to stop speaking Australian when you come in. <laughs> why in the game? What's my Y button do? Um, I believe it was radar. Now that I'm dead, I can't see any of my stuff. But don't you love Star Trek? Laggy. Yeah, I was getting a little bit of some rubber band in there earlier. I get it a bit, but like I'm getting it right now, real bad. I'm not even in a TFO. Insect space. Laredo. Yeah. Oh, what's um, Stu? What's the name of that ship you were flying on your Klingon? A D7 or D9? Um, D7. I think it was the D7. D7 heavy something. Uh, no. There's so there's two D7s. There's the Miracle Worker one, which is not what it is. Yeah. Or is it the Kelvin? Uh, it's not temporal. It's got command. What the fuck is it? Uh, D7 heavy destroyer. It's a 5-2, an experimental weapon. Yeah, yeah, that's it. I was looking for the Fed variant. Or, well, I may, I may, I... The Fed variant I is the uh, Kelvin one where it's like saucer section with the, um, uh, like one, the one warp core. Um, I don't know if you remember... Oh, yep, yep, I'm with you now. Who is it that would fly it all the time? It was, um... God, it's right on know. top of my head. I don't know. Uh, Yowalski. Yowalski used to fly it all the time. Yeah, that's why I don't... I yep. know Yowalski, I just don't watch his stream. He hasn't streamed in a while now. I heard some talk like he was yeah. gonna again here soon. Hopefully he does. He was a good tank, wasn't he? Yeah. Yeah, I think he's he's probably apex uh, in terms of that at this point. We'll have a hard time uh, matching his hit by rates, his damage intake, and then his DPS. All of those higher. Yeah, uh, and I don't know what the fuck he's doing to get that threat. Cause, I mean, my build is almost identical to his. I did a couple minor different things, but it wouldn't make that kind of a difference. The Kelvin time is not just the buddy. It, it's one of those ones you oh, can like nice. get the pack where you can like select which the one you want. It's the Einstein. Yeah, yeah. Freaking... Yeah, the Einstein 5-2 experimental weapon. I was looking at um. It's the one that Captain Kirk's dad was flying in the uh, yeah. first Star Trek remake movie. Yeah, yeah, the Australian. What? It's, um... <laughs> <laughs> well, his dad's uh. Fuck. Is um, is from the future? It's Thor. Yep, that's the one. It's Thor Australian. Uh, Hemsworth. It's Chris Hemsworth. Oh, okay. Chris Hemsworth is Australian. I thought he was from the Netherlands, dude. <laughs> really? Well, he's a Viking, isn't he? <laughs> Basically. <laughs> he's one good-looking good human. Yeah, I can't not agree with that. Yeah. I I love the fucking Last Avengers movie where like. They go to find him, and he's, like, fat, out of shape, playing Fortnite. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good play they did there. All right, how'd I do on that lurch? 
No idea. I left. Yeah, I don't either. Let me see. Duckyard. I don't feel like I made any progress. That's because I'm a moron and it's got to be a fucking battleship. Anyways, I got some potential damage on it at least. Alright, so what's a fast firing battleship that I have? Helena. Uh, a high tier French, because you have that uh, auto, that reload. The uh, Thunderer will do it. Is that French? No, it's English. I think that's got my uh, fastest reload. Have, I know it's. Oh! How many times do you need? Another like. I don't know, 60, 70? I know it's not high tier, but the St. Louis has got 14 guns, so that'd be main batteries, wouldn't it? It's got 14 main batteries. It's gotta be a yeah. battle. Singles. It's gotta it's gotta be a battleship though. Is that a battleship? Uh, yeah. I didn't think you was you're not using you were using a cruiser just then, wasn't you? I know. What? The Strasbourg yeah. might actually do it. I mean I, it's only got eight guns, but its reload isn't that bad. Yeah, no, we can do that. That makes sense. It does have a good reload time. Uh, yeah, Nick, I uh, I was like all wrong on picking this ship and doing what I did. It didn't help me in any way other than getting some potential damage to a cruiser, <laughs> which is something else that I needed. Yeah. That's but, one thing about the game. Like, if you do put on like, you know, a good couple hours in it on those like recharge, I think, yeah, it definitely would help a lot. Like, if I was on yesterday, like, and I didn't get on Star Trek, I would have got like two extra port slots and yeah. that would have helped. Strasbourg but, also has that reload booster. Yeah, yeah, that's right. It's immovable. Uh, how do you feel about a rando with it? Yeah, I'm fine with it. As long as the enemy team doesn't feel bad about it, you know, fine. Well, I want them to feel a little bad, like, for losing. No, they... They don't like me. I get focused. <laughs> At least I go out too damn far, but whatever. No, I'm ready to put you. Yeah, I know. I'm, uh, I'm just putting some shit on here. I have to buy some more fire flags. Hmm. Okay. Later, though. Go away! Why was I getting absolutely... Oh, well, the Expanse was good this week. Uh, cancel it for a second, Stu. What happened there? That was weird. They looked different that, than normal. That was me. Oh, it'll let me ready up without you ready? Or go to battle? That's weird. I didn't think it did that. I don't think the... Okay. I don't think the carousel's working 100%. Oh, so the little flag pluses aren't working. Gotcha. Why didn't that work? Hmm. I'm doing the mud times time device sort of yeah that okay but it, uh, do you have to have motivation off cooldown when you start your rotation before you hit it yeah so what you want to do is mud's time device and while that is working there will be a countdown you can activate kit modules so i'll do whatever kit modules it is you want to do and then motivation refreshes that so if mud's yeah. time device only has like two seconds you don't want to activate anything wait for that to get done relaunch it then starts you know spam your your whatever it is you want to spam and then yeah. hit motivation that resets everything you spam it again motivation resets everything and you keep doing that until mud's time device is running out and then you just wait a second relaunch it and then start over question for you uh-huh if you need a main battery hits, why are we doing random? Why not co-op? Random, they hide behind islands too damn much. Yeah, it's 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 hit or miss for me. Um, I would say on average, it's probably close to the same. Uh, this ship's a little bit slower. The bad guys just rush in, so anybody in faster ships get up there with torpedo kills and all that kind of stuff. Um, co-op, you know, they're hiding, they're coming out, the game lasts longer, there's more opportunity for a battleship to get more hits. Um, but that can vary both ways, you know what I'm saying? So for me, it's like, okay, I could do either one, and on average, I'm getting the same kind of result in terms of battery hits, but I can get more XP, money, all that kind of thing. If this was torpedo hits, it would be that all day long in DDs, right? Because I can just rush in, be the first one there, and get it. But I have a hard time 
achieving some things in co-op with battleships because they're so slow. The enemy comes straight, they're, they don't hold up, they don't wait, they don't position, they don't hide and come out later. So unless, if you're not first, then you're fucking missing out, you know? I got some please do when you put your day off, you need to add in things to your channel points. Yeah, I need to figure out something good for that. Speak Even stuff for Nam subscribers so we could sit here and screw with you. Yeah, no, it's for channel points for anybody that watches and gets channel points. Oh, no, there's one in there that said subscriber. Had to be a subscribe. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. I'm aware. Um, I'll, I'll check to... again after this. I'm not saying you're wrong. I have no idea what they are stock. Do you have the, uh, one of those voicings like your wife? I do not. Steal her, steal her, and you, you can talk like a woman. Yeah, yeah. Like right. <laughs> she would like that. Oh, well, if I had it, I'd do it. Why is my ambush only 152% where yours is like 300? Uh, is it fully upgraded? Ultra rare? Uh, uh, yeah, it's ultra rare Mark 15. What's your, uh,. Captain skill skills look like I have all of mine in the top left ones and then the t uh, bottom right kit so all the all the kit ones are fully maxed out um, yeah that's, that's why I'm left and I'm all on the left left and bottom left left and bottom left okay yeah so I'm top left and all top left all bottom right yeah I I think I, I literally I don't think I've respect my ground since like I made this character. Dude, I'm headed over to A. There's a cruiser about that over there that's on his left leg. I hit him with the citadel. Okay, I see him. He's really the only force over there, so. There's two I mean, battleships battle heading. Yeah, but they're they're a little ways like out. Five. There's a looks like there's a DD in there too. You about to beach? What the fuck's he doing? The cruiser wouldn't shock me if he was. Yeah, well he did. <laughs> about to blap him. So I smacked him pretty goddamn hard. He's probably panic or yep. mode right now. I just hit him once. Incapacitation. Need to get some fires going on these battleships, but. Why are you doing that? No, why are you turning so sideways? Damn it. Who, me? No, me. I, I think I had pressed E, which locks your, uh... Oh, yeah. Fucking rudder now I'm broadside to these guys. Which is not what I want to be. We got oh, three battleships. Tied, but I'm only broadside to a... Putuga. Putuga? Whatever the hell it is. That Japanese cruiser. Gotcha. That's the only thing on my side. I don't think he could sit it on me anyways, so... Too worried about it. Yes. All I'm saying is we need to start pushing some. I mean, yep. so far it's been pretty even, but. Yep, I'll start moving should. up. We'll start uh, working our way, way towards A. There's the DD. He's got some smoke on the north, south, southwest side. Yeah, waiting for him to show again. Trying to get some fires going on these battleships. Why did you know I work some motivation? Like, why wouldn't work just anything? I am not 100% sure why and how all that works. I just copied. Yeah. You need to read Mud's time device and then motiva motivation and see why. For motivation, it's just damage and healing. I had motivation before all this because I just think it's a good damage buff. Yeah, somehow motivation just procs Mud's time device. T 
tied up. Branch, BB, buddy. I could turn on a dime. But my jump still doesn't work, fortunately. Start going backwards. Oh, I got turned hard. I missed hard. Fujin. Yeah. Something else behind that island I can't see. I think it's a battleship. Which one? The one to the left? Uh, yeah, there's a battleship. He snuck in back there. Yeah, right there. Top left corner of it. Oh, that way. Carrier's yeah, almost in my range. Up here. Might be able to hit this carrier. Battleship just came up. I'm trying to burn out that uh, battleship to the left. Yep, I see him. I think he I can put his fire out that I started, so he think should I, be good. I think I can hit their carrier. I'm not going to waste time with the carrier. Yeah, work on that battleship to the left. He's damn near half health and he's on burning. He doesn't have yep. a repair. Got him. Doesn't look like he's moving either. Yeah, he's trying to hit reverse. Okay. Making a mistake there, buddy. You shouldn't have rushed. And Stu, you might want to back up to me. Yep, I'm in reverse right now. Running pretty good. The last while I an HE on him. Let me see about hitting him harder. Six. All their ships are over here. Shit, it's just me and you and the carrier fucking left. Oh, uh, yeah. God. Love it. Holy shit. You all get to smack. The rest of the team committed suicide. Yeah. By that Colorado again, I might commit suicide. Jeez, that's that's a good amount of Ford Five battleship. Where am I? Oh, flying the Borg battle battle zone. That doesn't matter anymore. It's nice not having to go to bed at 8 p.m. because I have to be up at four. <laughs> yeah. Fire. I'm a focus on the Colorado. Uh, to the left, he's given broadside. Okay. I don't have AP loaded, but. Turning in some. Um, I'm dead here on the next shell that hits me. I'll use two. Okay.
72 hours. Question of the day is what it usually is. If the whole enemy team is over by A, what the hell were they fighting over at C? Right. <laughs> <laughs> and why did they all die to it? Uh, A, A. I don't know if you have your fighter on or not. Or I don't. Ha I don't have one. I just have the spotter. Problem solved, sir. The ship is on fire. I don't know if you have a shot on that Fiji or not, but he's probably the easiest kill on the map right now. Yeah. In front of you. There's just too many okay. hitting me. Yeah, you're you're gonna have to go for whatever you can get. A uh, trip to the bottom of the ocean. Yeah, you're stronger. Oh, yeah, you're getting fucked. Yeah, uh, yeah. I don't know what happened to the rest of our team over there. So we have the two caps. And everybody else was yeah, gone. I just remember, we went over to A. There was another battleship with us. They all went everybody in. Everybody else was over there. They went in too far. I'm gonna look at all my other characters, and then I might jump on more ships. Do it. I'm gonna play a few, few more before I call it a night here. So all my reps are done on this. R and D's done on this. Not done. Queued. Admiralty's kind of. Oh, I've got like one more spec point or two. Yeah, I should keep doing this one. I'm at nine out of ten on tour duty. My uh, fed. Just because I keep rolling through it, just to keep spec points going and just a bit of experience. There you go, spec point result, special item. Twelve. We want a CV team. Science. So I have Mari and that will do. Hey, what next do? Um, How many main battery hits you get? I'm not sure because it's not over yet and I didn't look before I left. Unfortunately. Silly, silly. all the extra admiralty ships we'll get in the next three or four days if you've got a fair amount of klingon ships and then fed on the other side uh, i haven't done I admiralty ever since they changed the dilithium Shame on shit. You, nick what for bringing that up why oh, my damn ships i have to claim again <laughs> you don't even have to do that they, they changed that if you created a new character as soon as that's unlocked every ship you have it'll automatically give you the uh cards without Wait, unpacking them i'm still not doing it <laughs> yeah that's weird <laughs> that's something else i can write customer support about yeah. you, you open something yeah it's know. something causes it to happen i can't remember what the fuck it is yeah i've done it like you but i've never had to worry about it because 
every tune that I have up until that point, I automatic, you know, I already had them open for that reason, went through the work, and then new tunes, for somehow it just automatically did it, and I can't remember how that fucking happened. I think it was when I just hit that level with the tune that the Admiral, uh, Admiralty system unlocked. Um, is that one done yet? No, still, still in combat. One carrier was on the opposite side of their whole four, so it might take them a while to find it. Carrier, that's right. I wanted to do a random in a carrier. No, Joy, you're asking for trouble. What's, uh, what's that shame thing? on you for running the Admiralty? It's, it's just free experience. Yeah. And uh, you should be having to unlock each ship again for each character since mine doesn't seem to do that right now. Yeah. Uh, uh, I'm just working on, uh, I've got them all 10, like years ago but just working on compl uh, I want to make a like a mastered I want this there it goes See how we... what's development you know if with the recruit if they did what they did with the gamma as far as the accommodations you know having to be level four if yeah it's oh my God. or the reputations having to be maxed out at five yeah. the, the new one it's gonna be six That'd be nice. So that's that's, that's that'll be nice. That'll be bad. That if means it, you have to do double the grind. Well, it'll it'll put a huge population in the Klingon. No, I'm talking about the reputations for well the Klingon recruit. Instead of hitting level five and he's done with one reputation, he has to you know, to free up the recruit no, but rewards, with, he'd have to with, do six. For, no, but I'm pretty sure with Gamma they had tier six out of that point. Well it was really, like I, I don't think they did. I, I don't think they did either. But you did start with some of them completed, I believe. Well, you started yeah, out with uh, three of them. Three. Yeah, depending yeah. on what kind of tune. Right. So depending on your class. But you can also get it done twice as fast as you used to if you have six completed on any other character. Thought it was five. Six. I'm thinking they're actually trying to push selling the uh, auto boost. You know, we're gonna go ahead and boost you up for what? What is it? Two thousand. Zen. Yeah. Per rep. <laughs> They're out of their damn minds. But if you look at the rewards, the rewards aren't really anything fabulous. For me, the Batleth and the... See anything about the rewards. For the the... Batleth and the trait for the, the ground is, that is what's interesting to me for a, like a melee build. Like, I'm going to make a melee build Jemadar and then a um, the carrier build. But it's... Um, Find it. We go uh, tier eight. I don't have a tier eight. Do you do? Damn it! <laughs> I was gonna say, how the f holy moly don't you have a um? Gonna yell at you, Lurch. <laughs> what? <laughs> All right, the rewards what? at the moment. What they say? I'm saying there's gonna be more. <sighs> Ooh, I'll, I'll just, I'll, I'll just be work. happy if it like does account wide unlocks of like marks and shit like that. Cause that's so nice for like tunes that you're still working on leveling. Yeah. So you can go okay, claim those. So, so right now it's a for what they're telling us, it's a T6 scaling bird of prey. But it's a four. -two. Hey, look at that as well, right? It's missing one weapon and it only has nine console slots. How is it a fucking tier six? You have to get yeah, a fleet. Nick, give me that huh? link, whatever you're looking at. So I can't seem to find that damn thing. It's in the STO chart. But it's, yeah, it's a 4 2. That's what I noticed. It didn't have enough consoles. Yeah, and I was like, does it at least have an experimental weapon slot? But yeah, it only has six fucking weapons. And then it only has nine console slots. How is it a fucking tier six? Yeah, like at least the other Imchal has got an experimental weapon. I could say they've... they've all, all I'm saying is that boost. that's a tier five. They can call it whatever they want to, but the tier that's is tier determined five. by the fucking amount of console slots it has and weapons it has, and that's not a tier six. Not if they offset it the console slot for, let's say, an extra trait. If they put two traits on that ship versus, you know... Where they had the five and the six trait, it's still just yeah. the four. It still wouldn't that be wouldn't a bring it up another tier. 
Oh, uh, here's the stats. It's well. Three. It says tier six, hull modifiers 0.95, shield modifier 0.8, four weapons four, aft weapons two, two device slots. The only thing that makes it a, the only thing that makes it a tier six is it does have a starship trait, I believe, and that's it. Yep. Uh, it's Commander Universal, two Lieutenant Commander Universals, and a Lieutenant Universal. Like, so I'd say it's seating might be interesting, like, but. But but what is it? It's a it's a raider, right? You'll be happy I turned this Cleveland Black back into what it yeah. originally was. It's an AA cruiser again. Oh, nice. AA cruiser. So what? Like it's your secondaries do more damage than you do. Uh, my. Good luck for any aircraft trying to get close to me. I build. Like you want him to be oh, with you and like your, I'll your... have a balloon of protection over whoever's around me. And that's where we could build out like a, a div setup. Like I think we all should pick a tier six ship that we want, and all of us do a roll. One of us be AA, one of us be long range damage, the other one be I don't know spotting or something. Although it would still have to stay close to the AA to have that benefit. Unfortunately, I don't. I didn't see anything to extend the AA range, so I'm still stuck at what is it five six. Yeah, Something like that. on a on the on a cruiser. Well, on this cruiser. Yeah. yeah. But this cruiser is a multi-support, basically. If a destroyer gets near, I have radar to hunt his ass down and hydro. Oh no no no! Don't go over there. So I want to stay near you, but honestly, at the start here, there he's probably going to go after our destroyers first. See which way these guys are going. Enemy planes are coming over A. Oh, we got two carriers. Enemy planes over B. Okay. Oh shit. He's scouting out right now. Let's see if we can't hit. I'm gonna steer and stick near you right now. Have you been spotted yet? I haven't. I mean, my planes have, but... They're getting shot down like freaking no tomorrow. Lost a couple uh, there. You still got a few now. God, I've, never, I've never played a carry. This is cool. Yeah, well, it's not cool DD? to play one. It's kind of boring. There's a lot of flight time in playing the carrier. Well, I mean, it's the only flight time. Ooh, I got a fire. Yeah, but you're constantly in flight going to or coming. Yeah, it's fire. like one of the biggest things is your reload of squadrons and your flight time reduction is a big deal. I mean, boosting your damage and shit like that's all good. But if it takes you twice as long to get there, it doesn't matter if you're doing 25 percent more damage. You know, I mean, I'm yeah. no I'm no pro at fucking carriers, but that's just my thought on it. You're right. Well, you're the same, same thought with Star Trek. Like, right, you know, right. You never you know, hit something that you do damage. It's like any, any game, you're gonna be able to hit it to do it. Just, uh... Oh, this is cool. That water looks so smooth. Yeah, it's a little mod I'm using. I think about doing a video on Star Trek that just has to do with movement. How to do it, why it's important. Oh, I didn't put fucking camo on? God damn it. This, these ones are bombers. It's really fucking... Actually, this one isn't bad, but... Some of them you have to look, like, straight down to see your, your bomb dropping. Yeah, wherever the uh... Alright, I'm running out of protection over here. You've already done 14,000 damage. Yeah. I haven't done shit. It's actually not bad for me. I'm not like a great carrier pilot I mean, at all. Bombers. These are bombers, yep. So I come out. I'll try and dive bomb this guy right here. Uh, I just got um, tier 5 of my Cardi. So like, I've got a couple of like, extra marks. Then. So now I'll be better than finding it every day, which would be nice. 
the fuck does that miss? It's like right on. Wait, did that? Oh my god! It sucks too that they're not ready right away to like do another bombing run. You have to like wait a second. During that wait time, I'm usually trying to get my planes turned back around. Yeah. I was trying to like move right onto the next fucking target, but that didn't work out. Over pen with a bomb? Doesn't make a lot of sense to me. They know where I'm at now. <laughs> are they actually gonna put buddy submarines in this game? Just... Yeah, they're in testing. No, they are bringing them in. You, I don't uh, want them, but they're bringing them. They're gonna be useless. I mean, it's, you gotta be in like the right place, the right time, lined up, perfect. The only thing good about them that I keep hearing is they're gonna limit how many could actually be in per match, which that's great. Yeah. What, 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 they're not gonna be submerged though. Like, no, no, there is some merge. Oh, and only and only for so long. Yeah, they got uh, like okay. the air tanks are like 30 seconds, 45 seconds, then they have to bring uh, it up, fill up the tanks, and go back down. God, look at the fire on that shit. It's unreal. Hey, doing, Stu? Doing okay. I am staying between you and them. So oh. that was only like what, 3,000 damage. Yeah. I got a torpedo plane that's been debating about coming in. <laughs> but you got a good tick on that. That's a good thousand tick in my way. Well, this is what. Oh, I must. Oh, I got a fire on somebody. I think so. It's still ticking up. Yeah, it was on that battleship you just hit. We got a Iranian cruiser up ahead. I don't know if you get a hit on him or not. He's got a battleship right behind him. Uh, I can go up to the battleship. I mean, I have a hard time hitting anything with torpedoes, let alone a fucking cruiser. I'm gonna go after this Bismarck. It's it's pretty low. Uh, I'm gonna have to come at him a little different here. He's going behind an island. I have a shot on Bismarck anymore. Actually, come in on me. He sure as hell did. Look at that. Planes are gone. <laughs> I think that was funny. Motherfucker, I just used the repair and then I died. Or lost my planes. Or not, I died. The only thing keeping my ass alive. Our team is folding up, though, on the other side of the map. I'm trying not to pay attention to them. They're pressing. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, who's shooting at you? That's a DD. I'll try and go... I'll try and go after this DD over here. No. Two. He's just outside my radar range. I could pop it, but I don't think I'm going to hit him. Fucking uh, you got... Carriers detected. Behind you. Autopilot mode enabled. Ow, I'm almost dead. Okay, you just lost your A. Trying to move the carrier. Are you? I try to get a little closer to your friendly carrier behind you. Yeah, I'm, I'm working around. I'm together, working around. Pretty much protect you. Working around him. I should drop a fighter over it, maybe too, huh? Uh, the fighters. I use them on the fly at this stage of the game. Okay, say you got a whole bunch of fighters, enemy planes coming in. I'll launch a squadron, hit the fighter as soon as it's available, then I'll recall the squadron. That'll pop the fighters out while giving me the planes that I want. I gotcha.
Alright. Alright. Yeah, I see him. <laughs> yeah, right. I'm gonna go pink for that. Well, I don't know about that, but you'll definitely be an easier target. Nothing better than a floating island that ain't moving. Holy shit. God, they just shredded me. Flaming them down. You get an AA'd by three different people. Launch your fighters if you can. See, he's coming. Two. All right, they're capping both of ours. He's going it on purpose or what, but he's getting close to colliding. Start moving again. <laughs> I will here. I'm detected. But I mean, there's really nowhere to move to. I mean, we've lost the game, obviously. But. The enemy is about to win. Let's see what we have out there. The easiest target I can see is probably the Iranian, but. It looks uh, like that Agami's pulled off, so he doesn't quite have as much AA over there. Yeah, I mean, we're there's way too many over there. If I keep on the uh, Iranian, that's probably the best I can get that's on right now. Be the fastest kill. I'm pretty sure my carrier is sunk by now. Dude, store. <laughs> These guys just, these guys fucking spanked us. I got a new ship sitting here and I got no idea how it's good here. It's a premium ship. Promo? I bet. I what is know. it? I didn't get it. Yeah, that's a promo event ship. Which one? Or though. The Charleston. the Charleston. Ah. Yeah, the Charleston. I'm trying to think where I got that. That might have been from one of the, um, Referral codes, or yeah. yeah, I want to say it was that, and like the not the Texas, the war spike is what I got. I know from my re rejoining referral code. Oh, well, I, I didn't do a referral code, but I did the I lucked out because the war spike's an excellent ship. I need 10 more points for the next container. Bad advice behind the scenes collection. Oh, jingles. I don't even know. I don't even know. I think that's where you get the jingles commander too. Hey, we got Nick in here. Kinda. Halfway, there he is. All right, so carrier, not too bad. I mean, for not knowing anything about doing carriers, what I end up with? I suck. 33k damage. That's not bad for me. For that. Pretty sure I took last place. How'd we do? Let's see. I Bring doubt you took. I, I doubt you took last place. I'm sure I did. I didn't even get you over didn't... 10k damage. You so. did not. You took third to last place. No, not wow. bad. So there were actually people not playing the fucking game. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you don't want that. I don't want that. But when I'm in a support role, I can't really go out and fight. Yeah. Fight. I gotta stay over my objective. It's hard to to bring it bring it to them. All right, Nick. What are we playing? the drill oh you, yeah you, six. well you pick five. and we go five okay five i'm just i don't want to be in the pensacola i want to be in you the, know the drill we tell nick to pick and he waits for 30 minutes until he comes up <laughs> with some weird ass number that he doesn't even have a ship for 
Okay. Hey. A tier five, huh? Tier five. Believe it or not, I don't have any. Uh, random or uh, yeah. co-op? Which what would you rather do? Uh, do one co-op. Let me warm up, and then we'll see. My music sounds loud to me, but it doesn't seem like it's loud on the stream. So I wish I could balance okay. my stream input and like my headphone input separately. No, it's good. Are you ready, Nick? Uh, yes, sir. No, you're not. <laughs> yeah, I think he was trying to be nice, but I'm not that nice. <laughs> Hit the ready button, goddammit. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm ready, but I'm not exactly ready. No. Ready, ready. <laughs> yeah, we got we got to get Augie to play this game. Oh, he already made that perfectly clear. He's got, I'm going to keep working on it. I'm not giving up. I, I don't know if you've thought about it, but like, how long was he in the Navy for? Um, I'm not sure. I want to say like four or five years. It, I, I couldn't pick it, but he doesn't have any like PTSD. Uh, it's possible. I can't speak to that. That's the only like, I know, I know what, you know, he, he's a Star Trek guy and he likes that sort of game, but you know, he's saying the Navy. And you think he's like, oh, it might be that he just, he just like, you know, well, this is a game and I did this as a profession. I don't want to play it. Not like, thing. well, yeah, it could be that, but I can't see really PTSD being triggered by this game. It's no. not like World uh, War II where I think, you show landing on your ship nonstop. And I think more than anything, and Augie, if you're lurking, just correct me, but I think that, uh, you know, in Star Trek, I mean, he is you know the the top tier you know that everyone measures you know doing dps and that kind of thing against and i think it's kind of hard you know i mean it's almost i don't want to call it like starting at scratch because he has a lot of followers that'll follow him over here watch him still and join in you know but the other thing is too is that i think you know especially being ex-navy and those kinds of things i think you know community would rally around him like the warship community as well i i think he could be very successful I mean, he, you know, he's a full-time content creator is what he does, and I, I just feel like this this community could, you know, take him to an even next level than what Star Trek could just because of the size of the game and not to mention, like, Wargaming's support for, you know, the, the Twitch community and those kinds of things, content creators, is, is very good. I mean, compared to Star Trek's, which is non-existent, you know? Yeah. I, like, I was watching a, uh, yeah, most... It's a different game, but I was watching an Australian uh, NBA 2K YouTuber. Uh -huh. Yeah. And I, it, it, whatever their program is, I think he must be in it. Like, so he was. I was watching a video of his, and he was just saying like, he was giving away a card that's worth. It's similar to Star Trek, you know. You put in 150, 100 dollars, and you basically, you know, one to three sort of good graded chips. Uh, yeah. Cards, not chips. So. Like, but like once a week he gets to give one of those away to yeah. one of his followers or his viewers. Yep. And I know like uh, Warships, like they have like a set, you know, CC program you can apply for if you're hitting certain stats. And then they supply you with, uh, you know, codes to give away, like enough to give away multiple codes every day through the week. And then they get renewed. And, you know, there's, there's a lot of support when it comes to, you know, the content creation. On top of like featuring him and stuff like, uh, there's a guy I've been watching on uh, World of Tanks. His name is Skills for something. I can't remember exactly. 
but uh, he's fucking hilarious. He's really good. And I was watching the official um, World of Tanks stream the other day, and like one of these like um, epic drops you could get was a uh, commander, and the commander was fucking like him. <laughs> and then there there was like a few commanders, but they were all content creators that they had modeled fucking commanders after. I'm like, dude, that is so That's cool. Is. Yeah. It, I just thought that was so fucking cool. Right, this is like a bloody random battle, but they're like, everyone's hanging back. Yeah. That's more, that's more hits for us. I realize I'm like, wait, no one's moving up. Hey, what are you talking about? I'm getting like... Oh, fuck. No, off. no, I'm about to torp my friend. That's all my fault. I'm so sorry. Oh, God. <laughs> my bad, bro. My bad. No excuse. I just wasn't paying attention. I wish you could hear me right now. <laughs> really sorry. It's not a bot, is it? No, it's a human, too. Fuck. Sorry. Yeah, he's talking mad shit right now, and, and I deserve it. He's not wrong if he's like, I hate you. Is he trying to torp <laughs> me back? That's what it looks like, almost. <laughs> I still don't blame him. That was just totally not fucking paying attention. Come on, break out the apologies in chat. Uh, I'm trying to win still. He's okay. I mean, he only lost a little bit of health. Could have been worse. I'm getting fucked right now. Could be on his friend list, and he really fucked you in the long Yeah, time. right. <laughs> God damn it. Line shot over the mountain. I think I'm gonna hit the mountain. Where's another ship? Oh, uh, yeah, it's way back in the back somewhere. Yeah. It's over. In I thought I did more damage, but I've only got 38,000 damage. That's that's not bad. I got 23. Got me beat. Got me beat. <laughs> I've been avoiding shells. <laughs> Huh? Well, you just, you like, got more than both of us. I got uh, four five star, three enhanced incapacitations, eighty nine hits. I think that's three citadels. I don't know. I got I got one torpedo, one citadel, and I'm at twenty three k. Citadel's that black one on the bottom for you? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I've got three citadels. Three planes shot down, one torpedo. Full steam ahead. Where the frick did he go? Damn thing. He just dropped off the radar. I just zoomed in and there's nothing there. <laughs> yeah. There he is. There he is. Oh, he's hauling ass. Yeah. He is, well. I think he's gonna end up beaching up against the mountain. Yep, there he goes. Talking crap in chat now. <laughs> like, alright, we've won. Let's move over to shit talking. <laughs> it's what I gotta do.
fire starter. Doing. Got him. Got him. Doing. God damn it, now I'm pink. Yeah, I know. I got the warning. Unsportsmanlike conduct. Dude. It'd been like three days since I was pink, man. There we go. It's not a record. Yeah, but... Maybe we should start one of those timers for you. Yeah. <laughs> How many days I've been pink? Huh. All right. What we got? I told him shit happens. Don't be a dick. What'd he say? I wasn't even paying attention that the TF-44 team should learn how to torp? <laughs> I did. I hit him with three of my fucking torpedoes. Yeah, so you, you're definitely hitting the target. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's way better than normal. There's a, I, have, I have a flag damage caused by ramming and then reduce damage. So like your ba battleship yeah. just go along ramming everyone. <laughs> All right, what tier and what kind of game? What do you think? Five or six? Here we go again. <laughs> uh, can I send five? Yeah, I don't care. I got plenty of different fives that I can play, so whatever you want to do, I dude. I just want to keep powering through this one. Okay. Uh, random or co op? Um, I don't know, I enjoy the co ops, but like random gets you more, so I don't know. Pick one. <laughs> You, you go. You pick your leader. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna pick random every time because you get more from it. Unless you're after like torpedo hits or something like that. But if you're trying to get out of a uh, ship, you're gonna get more win or lose from a random. Yeah. Okay. But if you're having more fun in co-op, then I'm fine with that too, dude. So I mean, it's up to you. Uh, I would say I'm having more fun in co-op. If you go, go well, let's we do that do, then. Uh, let's the just. I feel, I feel, get just about I feel as much less rain. guilty just kind of going balls deep. Friggin'. I mean, it doesn't make any difference to me. So we'll go, we'll go co-op, and then we'll do a, um, we'll do a, um, what Lurch just right. said after this. Yeah. Yeah, you a get what? really good experience in operations too. Yeah. Well, that's just, um, tier six only. Um, yeah. But you're gonna have to run your tier six in there. We'll do that next. Oh, it's available in nine days. Uh, my my. That'll probably, probably be my last one after the co-op. Cause I'm I'm not dying, but I don't want to be dying. I'll have some before and after pictures to put up tomorrow on Discord of my. Old and the new garage door. Mine finally came in after two and a half fucking months. Oh, how old? How? What's the age of your current one? Uh, it's not the original. I installed this one probably about ten years ago, and it still works fine. Oh. But um, the new one I got, it's a little more decorative. So I got my house painted like a month or so back, and so just trying to get everything updated. Oh, you could be like my next door neighbor. Or guy across the street, actually, not really next door. But anyways, he took his garage door. You know the panels that have the squares? Uh-huh. This son of a bitch, he painted the garage door red in each <laughs> individual square pink <laughs> with purple highliner. It's like, a, it's like a big fuck you to all my neighbors, yeah. <laughs> and no, it's not going to be like that. Mine's going to match the color scheme of the house that the fucking HOA decides is good. Which, my wife's the president of the HOA, so it's good. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm ready now. Oh, okay. Thank you. I keep forgetting. No, I, I was zoning. I thought you were talking shit to me for not clicking it. No, no, no I, I, I just <laughs> completely freaking forget that I got to ready up every time. You said random on elite, right? Yep. On elite. <laughs> it's like added an extra. Like that. I want to see if this was working. 
I just want to get these. Well, once I get this line going, like I could just, yeah, you know, we can flip flop between five and six on this line, and then I love that skin too. I know, I do too. I don't care if it's pink. It looks fucking good. Ah, uh, so if it was purple, it'd be even better. Like, yeah, I, I mean, it's I like, like a, purple. it's a purpley salmon oh. glowing pink. color. Let's call it that. Pink. Yeah, pink. Oh, the bottom part's <laughs> in the water yet. Yeah. Like, no, like, like when I go and get a Slurpee, I always get a purple straw. <laughs> I don't know, it's it just, just tastes know, better. It's yeah. like it's like I chew with my mouth open because that airflow just makes my food taste better. You know, it's just. <laughs> <laughs> my wife's like, "Do you gotta chew with your mouth open?" I'm like, "Yeah." Twenty something years later, you're still fucking asking me that shit. The answer is yes. I to hate it growing up with you. I had a problem yeah. with my brother, my younger brother. He loved chewing his mouth open. Some things just stay the I same. He it right across the goddamn table from me. So. Wow. Still watching the same Star Trek episodes 20 something years later, and yes, I chew with my fucking mouth open. This is. How long has it been, Mr. and Mrs. Stu? Uh, we've been married, um, I don't know, I was 22? Maybe you should ask her. I'm kind of curious if she'll get pissed off that you don't remember. No, no, I'd send my Facebook, so I just check that if I'm ever <laughs> unsure. <laughs> I was 22 and I'm 37, so this year is gonna be. 15, 16 years, something like that. And then we've been dating since I was, I was 18 and I'm 37, so almost 20 years. Fucking crazy. I feel old. I don't want to feel old, you know? No, 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 what about this? You've been dating since I was three. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> 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 that's that crazy shit though like like i graduated high school and like i guess those kids are adults now that were born yeah. that same time uh who's in the destroyer lurch you have a destroyer heading to your immediate starboard yeah i just got i'm getting shots in the womb i'm just preoccupied right now i can't yeah. really worry about them you have uh, a, uh, you have some backup coming around behind you, and it is not a bot. But I don't know what the fuck he's doing. He's launching torpedoes. I think he wants to kill you. <laughs> I don't know what gave you the idea of that. I mean, he's shooting at me. But yeah. No, 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 yeah. I'm, no. Our, yeah. our, you, you have a friendly cruiser behind you that just launched torps. Oh, okay. Well, I, I got a good couple thousand damage. I took a torp right on the nose. <laughs> oh, fuck. Let's see if I can if I can get a shot off. We have a cruiser beached. Uh, Nick, right on the corner. Is yeah, that the Krensky or the Krenny. yeah? Yeah, I'm heading for him now. I'm just gonna machine gun, hopefully. Oh, that's a battleship. Uh -oh. I honestly remember uh -oh. having an altercation with that Rick before, so I don't really feel bad about calling him a dick. Who's Rick? That uh, Rick 35, the one that made the comment about you torping him. Oh. Yeah, who the fuck's that guy think he is? Well, I, I killed the guy with the talk well, yesterday the day before, and he didn't say one word. <laughs> yeah. Was it a bot? <laughs> no, no, no. It was a player. I am engaging. Yo, I'm, I'm trying to engage the battleship, but he's looking at you. Now he's focusing on me. You're good. Uh, uh, these, got own, <laughs> Nick's got his own problems coming around that bin. Yeah, these yeah. bots are kicking our team's fucking ass. Yeah, they are. This is crazy. I'm not always thinking much for the what team. the fuck? <laughs> I mean, we do have a few bots on here, but. It's YOLO time. We gotta turn it up a notch. Yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. I'm just going YOLO. You're about to get uh, rammed. Uh, according oh, to my oh, radar, you're, you're you're my mini map. You're definitely getting rammed right now. <laughs> the whole time Stu's talking about doing random. We can't even handle bot right now. <laughs> They're cheating somehow. Whoa. I just go fucking ball.
Now would be a good time to use your jump. There, Stu. Jump? My my back step? I got this. I'm not worried. Yeah. Once, you know, in about a half a minute, yeah, we, uh, I, I finished off the cruiser first. That'd be one less yeah. gun on your ass. Yeah. And I want to launch. He's not dead. What the hell? Are you missing him? No, I hit him. You didn't do any damage. I know. I think I overpinned him. I know. He didn't hit him. Oh, now the bombers decide to start hitting their target. <laughs> yeah. That's three against six in an AI. What the hell? Wait, but how many AIs though? We have one, two. We only have two AIs. I want to turn too much more. No. I'm gonna pull back three. behind this island here. I mean, we've lost this as is, so <laughs> unless no, no. that goddamn carrier decides to start doing something. I'm gonna carry it's us it. to victory, right? Meow. Orky, what up, dude? Uh, we're just getting our ass kicked by a bunch of bots, which is kind of embarrassing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I Where the hell is our carrier? Oh, there he is. Oh, if you count your plane with your AA damage, you've probably done just about as much as I have. But... Well, matchmaking monitor still is not working, so. Let's go ahead and turn that back off. Carry your heart out. Yeah, I'm I'm trying hard. Yeah, because I kind of went full kamikaze in. <laughs> ram, full ram mode. Oh, I, I drifted around the ram. I like, and then started laying into him, which is really cool. I seem to stay shielded from these other motherfuckers. You should have brought that cloaking device over from Star Trek. No. So should have been. Oh, maybe I'll just cap them and win the game. Where can I hide? <laughs> yeah. You just, need a, you just need a DD to respawn. You, and, you'd um, have to kill their smoke. carrier for you to hide. Kill the carrier? Let's do that yeah. then. She's going to have you spotted the whole time. Oh, there's a fucking DD right there. Uh, the DD doesn't help either. Is any bot on this not shooting at you right now? Maybe we can get their attention. Now. That's sure. most most of them are. Yeah, it was only Stu and uh, Carrier bot. Is the carrier? Is our carrier bot? A bot? You know, mm, I don't know, but they're all dead, so it really doesn't matter at this point. You didn't hit that carrier this dude. Dude, I, I tell I you what, him. leave the match. Leave the match? Yeah. I get a lever's penalty. He'll be dead in a few there is no lever's penalty in this. Oh, actually, yes, there is. Uh, but if... The way the uh, co-op works, if it's nothing but AIs left, it draw... Instead of a loss, it gives you a draw. But yeah. since you're our last player, you yeah. don't really have that option. <laughs> right. No, no, yeah. But he just got, like, half of that carrier's health. Like, he just... I just citadeled him. I'm gonna take oh, care of this yeah. fucker right here, and then, I don't know. Right up your ass. Yeah, I see him. Yeah, we can one shot him quickly. Well, maybe. I got AP loaded right now. Yeah, you just one shot him quickly. He'll most likely overpen. The destroyers really don't have much armor, so the show goes in one side and out the other. Really? Oh, bitch! No! No! <laughs> Fuck! Slow motion. Dead. Oh, <laughs> oh, that's a few torpedoes. Motherfucker. Oh. All right, let's do an operation, and then that is fucking it for me. And I'm still pink. God damn it! God, I only got, I got like a fifth of what I got in that last game. Oh, the good thing about the operations too. There's go no pink. way how you can fuck up not going pink. Can I get unpink by running it? Does it count? Yeah, it counts. <laughs> Good. But you can't do friendly fire in operations, so. Good. So that's uh, going to be a tier six. Yep, yep. Orky, how's your night? How'd your stream go? 
Uh, what do I want to run in next? I need to be in the Pensacola. I can't be in the Omaha, can I? You gotta be in a 2 6. Pensacola! I don't care what it is. It's good. Be a two six. How long did you stream for? It seemed like you, uh, you were on for a while, man. Valorant. That game seems to be uh, doing pretty good looking at the uh, the category there. Well, Just woke up from a nap as well. Legends, That's uh, nice. Eight hours? Yeah. Jesus, dude. I don't know how you do that. But I streamed Star Trek for about three hours or so, about two hours into this, so it's five hours, I guess? That's not bad. I break it up, it doesn't doesn't seem as as crazy. Mo said she was going to stream tonight, and then she changed her mind. Mrs. Do. Yep. Should change her stream name to Mrs. Do and see if she uh, notices. Yeah, right. Who is that? I think you should change her stream name to Popeye. Popeye? Yeah. I don't like. She's got the mouth of a sailor. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> she is like a Canadian pirate. <laughs> Am I? Yeah, I did it. Uh, I did the same thing last week. I think in total is five, six hours, which for me is is quite a bit. I streamed Living Valorant again. Okay. I played that a little bit when it was in that little beta drop thing. It wasn't bad. What's oh, it, for me? Uh, it's funny. I like I've been playing League of Legends for like eight years now, and I haven't even touched Valorant. It's the same company. I just don't. <laughs> okay, you're loving it. I got you. Not not living it, or is that really kind of one and the same, right? It is. All right, we're gonna do Operation. Change my fucking ship. No. Trip and boo. Oh, this one's only got one gun on the fucking front. Whatever. Whatever. I need the snowflake, so. They still haven't done ended that? No. I don't know wow. what the deal is. Lurch. Yeah, no, I just changed ships. I just went ahead and mastered oh, that ship that I was in. I need a commander in this ship. That would help, huh? Well, they say you don't need a commander anymore. Yeah, you do if you want your some of your shit to matter. I thought I did this. Why? Why? What? What the fuck? All right, oh, so we're gonna go. We're gonna go with Rumble, my transformer captain. Do I have a different commander I can give him? Can. I've got a. F well, I want to leave my cruiser in a cruiser, so. Or do I just want to make a. No, so your commanders now, you can use, like, say you have three ships from the same nation. Well, no. If it's not premium, it doesn't fucking matter, but. Because it'll cost too much to move them around. Are you using a premium ship right now? No. Okay. Yeah, I wouldn't move your commanders around right now at all. So if you need a new one, just recruit one, but. The I'm only time I would move the commander out, like if you're in the Dallas and you're moving up to the next level in that ship and you don't plan on keeping the Dallas, go ahead and move your commander yeah. up to the next level with the new ship. Well, I'll, I'll go, I've got a six commander in at the Omaha and I've got a four commander in the Phoenix, the tier four Phoenix that I'm not going to use. And this current one in the Pensacola is a three. So I just moved the one in the four to the three yeah if you're not going to play that ship anymore but do if you move it though in the tech tree stuff so this is different for premiums but you'll only get like half or zero of the commander's skill abilities applied to you until you grind out enough xp on it or pay elite commander or i think you can also pay to blooms as well so if you move it up just know that 
there's a cost of doing that, either in time or doubloons or elite commander XP. Uh, winning tonight? I don't know, man. Let's see here. Mm, more defeats than winning. If we win this next one, we'll be about a we'll be about a fifty fifty. Figure that out. I don't think we've won one yet, have we? Yeah. Huh. Yeah, we've won a couple. Are you Team Kong? Or Godzilla? Uh, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what that means, Orky. I'm sorry. That's a cool, uh... Um, I like Godzilla better, if that's what you're asking. <laughs> Oh, what are you doing? And the more I think about that, I'm kind of torn, you know. I mean, if I'm in a boat, I probably want Godzilla on my side. If I was in the land, I'd probably take either one of them. I don't know. I mean, Godzilla's got like fucking like fire shit. It spits out, right? And then Kong's just fucking badass. Is that what we're talking about? Are we talking about Godzilla and King Kong? I'm not. I'm no, not. you're talking about Godzilla King Kong. I don't know what the hell. Not you, about. Lurch. I, I want King Kong. I want King Kong because he can climb buildings. I mean, yeah. I mean, if I'm in an urban environment or a jungle, then probably King Kong. Okay. But if I'm around like water and ocean kind of stuff, like I'm probably going to lean towards Godzilla a little bit. What'd you think of that last uh, Godzilla movie? It was, it was pretty fucking good. I enjoyed it. It reminded me a lot like it could go right with uh, Pacific Rim, which I thought was a good movie, too. Coming out with a new... Oh, really? They're coming out with another one? That last one I thought was great. King Kong versus Godzilla. Okay. Are you ready? I am ready now. Here we go. We're going to go out on a win right now. I can feel it. I can feel it. It is a campaign mission, right? Yeah, but you can lose still. We've done that. Well, We've lost the last one. one. Yeah, the, f the first Pacific Rim was really good, and the second one wasn't half bad either, but I, I really enjoy the uh, the first one. To me, I put it in the category of, like, Pitch Black and some of those other movies where it's not, like, it's not, like, for everybody, but it's, like, really good, you know? In fact, the best movies out there are movies that aren't for everybody. They're just, like, really good at what they are. It's, like, a narrow kind of focus. Trying to think what other movies are like that that are really good. There's not many of them. I know how the movie always compared to the other sides like Transformers, you know, like that's for like everybody. And it's not bad, but it's not like like whose favorite movie is the tr like one of the Transformer movies, right? Nobody. A kid. Did anybody hate it? I'm probably not very many. It was it was it was like good. I'm like, I'm never going to watch it again. It was made for everybody. Oh, I mean, the same technically could be said about uh, Game of Thrones. You know, one of the best shows, probably, uh, you know, probably someone said the best show ever. It was definitely not made for everybody, though. I mean, it's... Yeah, that's, you know, what the, well, that's what your point is. Like, right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that one, I, I would say they did a good job at it, like, not being made for everybody, but still capturing a massive audience, right? Because it yeah, was, like, like, wildly successful. That was what I was going to say, like, yeah, yeah because, it, it, yeah, my parents would watch the first few episodes, and they were like, uh, nah, we're not enjoying this sort of, like, stuff. Yeah. But then it was just, like, the massive audience it had. Yeah, I'd agree. I, I think they did, they did really good with balancing that, right? I was just thinking about it. I know it doesn't really apply to these games as much, but have you ever played Marvels on stream? Or I have not. On, on I mean, I've played it like with other, yeah, yeah. I've played it on other streams. I just said like Marvel and picked my shit and you know, the rest was up to, 
It's up to yeah, Jesus, I guess, right? Yeah. I always just find it, it's like a little bit of fun, but it's like... Yeah. Like, yeah, if you knew you were like five or ten minutes, like, like this, if you knew... Yeah, like right now we could be playing stream. fucking marbles. Now that we're talking about it, it's launching. So if we played marbles on stream, we would never wait for a fucking match to launch. Because that's how RNG... <laughs> <laughs> RNG Jesus works. <laughs> yeah. Like, you brought it up, and it launched the fucking game. <laughs> Good old Murphy's Law. Start battle. That's just a way to get through a traffic light start doing something. Yep. I always find it funny. Like, I've got planes on this sh ship. But how do they launch? Catapult. Really? Catapult. Wait, what? Did you ever watch like war documentaries and stuff, man? Catapult. This uh, this ship's got two guns on the back. American carriers use catapult systems to this it, day. Is this a this isn't a French ship, but it's got two weapons on the back? For me, I always watched uh, um That's a Russian Seoul. ship. Yeah. I did American uh, I did Australian history and I did uh we did a semester on corpse. Hitler, not on World War Two. We did it on Hitler himself. Yeah. And so, like, you know, him, him as a child, and his education, World War One, and yeah, his political career before he became fucking yeah, you know, high Hitler, and yeah, you know, all that. Aspiring artist. Yeah. He, oh yeah, yeah. He lived in the country across uh, Belgium. Not Belgium. It was the other way. Um. Now it's slipping my mind. Austria? Austria, yep. He's not even Wait, he's not even German born. Huh? What do you think of the Wonder Woman movie? The new one? Um, I was not impressed, to be honest with you. Uh, the first one is probably I don't wanna say like my favorite movies, but I, I really, really enjoyed the first one. Um, the second one, not so much, man. I just, I mean, like, it wasn't, like, bad. It just wasn't good, you know? Wow. First one, though, for sure. I, I, I love it. It's excellent. I'm gonna get tagged. Yeah. You ever watch, um... It's a fighter, maybe like a robot fighting. I uh, can't remember its name. Battlebots. I didn't enjoy it, it at Hugh all. In it, it was. Yeah, in. yeah, I agree. I mean, it was just kind of. It kind of went. It didn't have any kind of progression, right? It was just kind of like. I don't know. You know, and there was no like enemy that was like really trying her limits. It was, yeah, it just, it wasn't, it wasn't very good. It wasn't very good at all. Which really kind of bums me out, because I was hoping it, it would be, given how much I liked the first one. Yeah, I told you it sucked. I haven't even seen it. <laughs> yeah, it is all bad. To me, I'm just, I, I don't like the new one, plain and simple. I like the original. Have you watched the first one? Yeah, uh, I watched the first one. I thought it was no, good. There's no damage and it's there. The movie's fine, I just don't yeah. like it. The Wonder Woman character. You got problems. I love her. Wait, oh, do we have to head to where Lurch is going? Oh, we do, don't we? Oh. So not that I have long way around. You got different tastes, that's all. Yeah, no, no. I understand. I, I told my wife that she wasn't in the picture. It would either be her or my my new Russian girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> is, she, is she happy about that one? <laughs> she don't fucking care. This is bullshit, so... <laughs> Thank God somebody else is willing to take your ass away. <laughs> I know, I think you're getting down to that carrier, but I need to heal. Is the extraction point going to be the same place? No, it, it, it's anywhere on that west coast. Or the west edge. Yeah, there hasn't been a lot of good movies out this year, obviously. It's all the COVID bullshit, but uh, Wolfpack was, uh, was that? No, Greyhound. Greyhound was a pretty good one. I enjoyed that quite a bit. Tom Hanks. It kind of came out the perfect time. So I was just like getting into this game and then like that 
movie was basically like this fucking game, which was kind of cool. Both carriers are in. I got um traverse speed on my captain. Oh, God, it makes so much difference. Another good one that's been out for a while is uh, Fury. It's a World War II uh, tank movie with. Um, oh yeah, I've seen that. That was a, I love that movie. That was that was really really good. Really kind of is just kind of raw. Like if you're into like I I'm a big World War II buff documentary stuff, and that was just like a raw Saving take of it. In the movie theaters, I'll never do that again. That was a little too much. Yeah, Inglorious Bastards I really liked too. It was a little kind of different in the way they went with that, but it was it was still pretty pretty fucking good. I watched the start of that I, when it like when it came out, and I watched it with my dad, and when he started to scalp the person. Oh yeah. Like, All right. That's it. Off. Yeah, it's kind of weird too because that most of that movie or a lot of that movie was in um, Brad Pitt. Yeah, yeah, he's he's good. Most of Inglorious Bastards was in subtitle, and it, and it was weird because I'm not like real fond of fucking reading and shit like that, you know. But it was weird because I was thinking about the movie like for the next couple of days, and it I don't remember reading anything. I just remember like hearing everything in English, but it wasn't, which was kind of a weird thing. And like any other movie that was mostly subtitles, I'm never gonna fucking watch. So it uh, it was definitely good if I, I definitely liked it. Let me put it that way. If I sat through the whole fucking thing. Oh, you little bastard! What the hell? You're right there, Lurch. I think I'm gonna die here. Bye, Lurch. There it is. I still haven't hit the damn CV or found the bastard for that matter. I'm getting in the I haven't seen him yet either. Trying to flank him. You just never know where the fucking next group of enemies are coming out at. Yeah, I think I'm dead now. He just set a fire and I can't put it out, so. Oh, uh, one of my towers is out. Yo! Uh, well, there's the Kuma. That means the carrier's right behind it. I'm going down. Fire on him. I got a fire down on that Oba. Abo, Oba. Yep. On. He's got a couple yeah. on him. I put a plane up in the air to keep him spotted for right now. Where so do we you need got to go? 15 oh, do we seconds. need to turn around to that Kuma? Kuma? It doesn't, it doesn't yeah, say Yeah, there's an area right behind the Kuma that you need to kill. So, oh, just oh, turn oh, around oh, and go oh, that oh. Kuma? Yeah, there's a, the Kuma, a destroyer, and a carrier. The carrier is the primary target. Uh, the others are defense. Okay. They're still That's hanging well, out in that island. Uh, destroy Kuma. Okay. All right. Have we lost Let anyone yet? Oh, Lurch. Yeah, me. Let's Thanks for uh, noticing. <laughs> All right. Hey. Let's go. Let's focus that um, cruiser. It's coming around the left. Hang hard left if you can. And then we'll go. And then we'll go after the carrier. I think we got to get. Like uh, World War II movies, one movie I do suggest. It's my favorite movie of all time. Empires of so, the Sun. Uh, no, The Longest Day. Okay. I don't think I've seen that. It was made in the 50s, 60s, 60s, I think. Watch out for that destroyer. It's World War II, John Wayne. It's like three and a half hours long. Is that the one we were yeah. talking about where they were shooting the paint? The paint no. round? No, no, no. That was Kelly's Heroes. That's right. Yeah, I realized that's too, where I was sitting. I'm like, he's going to freaking talk me. Okay, we don't need the Ismail down there. I don't know why he's following. Well, All right. the carriers are down here, so I'm going to be that way. Yep, let's get that carrier. You're doing fine. The carrier's on the other side of the island. I think Stu's got a better chance of hitting the carrier than you. You're going the opposite way. Well, I know, but um, the destroyer had it was broadsiding, and I'm like, oh, there's going to be like... The destroyer's heading to intercept Stu right and now. And I threw barrage of torpedoes coming my way, so I thought I'd just go this way and be safe. Well, what yeah. I'm saying is somebody needs... Out of the three, we don't need three people over there. Somebody needs to go back to the fleet for de defense. Yeah, that battleship... <laughs> uh shouldn't be here no he's too damn slow to catch up 
if he goes if battleships go down there unless it's french they're pretty much out of the rest of the battle so they're spending the rest of their time just sailing to everybody all right where's that dd at i don't know but i see the uh he's got me spotted wherever he is there he is Hard left. Yep. So you try to end the DD up first, if I can. If you can, DD, yeah. Uh, Got him. Otherwise, he's just going to nuke people. Got the DD, and the carrier's almost down. I'm going to start moving back and taking the shots at him. Yeah. He's on fire. I got the carrier. I'll, I can. Yeah, you guys need to start heading back to the group. Yep. You can pretty much count the battleship out for the rest yeah. of the match. Yeah, except, uh, yeah. Yeah, we need to haul ass back. Uh, I'm on the, I gotta, I'm gonna have to go around to that other carrier. Yeah, just go around that island that's, that you're going around and then hang a hard right. I'm gonna try and cut off the rest of this group coming up. They're just getting well, in my usually firing works range. Is the carrier spawns in down here, where you guys are at, and the other one usually spawns in over at D1. So, usually, the first group goes off chasing this carrier, and then... Once this carrier is dead, the other groups already started headed to the other carrier. So this okay. group right here goes back and reinforces yeah. the friendly. We've got three fucking battleships over here. How long are these torps? Six, six kilometers. I well, I wanted to heal before I went down there. Six kilometers. Jesus. Well, let's see if we can start getting some fires on some of these. They're all fucking all right. aiming at me. Lurch, so where do I need to be heading? Uh, oh, head follow back me. To our friendly carriers. Turn right a little bit more. Yep. All right. Carriers, yep. All last Carrier. one there. Because right now our friendly carriers that we're supposed to be protecting are under uh, torpedo bombardment. Yep. <laughs> We're gonna have a hard time, I think, finish this and this one out. I want to know where the hell the rest of the team went. Nobody's over here. Ships. No, no, no I, I know you, I know do, but there should be a, another two people. Well, that Ismael is hitting the wrong oh, way. Oh, they're over here with you guys. Well, I knew the battleship. What's the DD doing over here? The DD should have been the one going over that. Uh, those other. There's just a fucking gang of these battleships over here, Jesus. I'm heading that way, Stu. They're gonna fuck me. See that Aoba? Yeah. Any way you can nuke him, because he's coming into Torp range on. He's gonna nuke the shit out of them. I don't, know about, I don't know about nuking. He's the one past the Kuma. I gotta somehow nice. bob and weave until I can get behind this fucking island, or I'm toast. Uh, my ogies are an issue, but they're not the primary right now. <laughs> Come on. I'm trying to take that DD out. It is a clusterfuck right now because yeah. everyone decided to go after the carrier. It seems. Yeah. I don't even know where the hell the other two people went. Yeah, see, I'm like out of the battle right now. Fuck. Another DD, if you, if, yeah. We had to take those things out. I, I this, where is this DD in this smoke? Uh, Nick, if I were you, I'd stop lobbing chills at the battleships. No? Yeah. Because what you're doing, you're becoming spotted by them, and they got better guns at that range. <laughs> okay. Try heading towards islands for protections. Yeah. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get to this smoke before these guys fucking nuke me. And hopefully you can get some torpedo hits on them. I don't know if mine are off cooldown yet. No, I'm nope. talking about Nick's okay. Omaha when he gets close enough. Fuck, I'm done. Oh, actually, you're not in the Omaha. You don't have torpedoes, do you? Five seconds. Come on, 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 Bitch. So just keep for our carry? Yeah. So right now our carrier has no support. 
Oh, I'm fucking dead. Ugh. Holy shit. And I can't believe I lasted that long. I had six kills, though. It's not I'm half sure bad. Half regardless. Yeah, okay, I'm, su I'm surprised I made it that long. I was shadowing those three fucking battleships. There's just no way. Fuck, I'm finally almost back in this. Oh shit. This carrier's having to engage this battleship with his secondaries. That's ridiculous. <laughs> well, we could say goodbye to our uh, mercenary pay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Fail. Yo. I mean, we at least charged a retainer, right? Like win or lose? <laughs> yeah, we'll get something. It's just crap. Yeah, well. That's right, though. That's fun. We gotta get we gotta get Nick up to a tier eight so we can uh, be doing the. Yeah, the biggest problem with these operations is you really need to go eight. in with a group that has a understanding. I don't think the the pugs we joined knew yeah. what they were doing. There was no reason for all of them to follow. Battleship can't get can't get that far. Let's uh, let's finish up with a random battle tier six. Okay. Are you guys? More surveying. Here. What do we want to run? We're going to run the Perth? Is that what we want to do? Is it Perth 5? Uh, it's 6. What are we going to run? We, oh, we're going to run the ship that's going to irritate Nick. Nick don't have it. <laughs> well, I, I, it, I just bring my Omaha 5, but I probably should bring the Pensacola at 6. Yeah. I want to bring the Omaha because I like, just want to get, get out of it. Bring it. Bring it then, dude. After we get rid of uh, Stu for the night, we'll run some with the Omaha. <laughs> <laughs> I'll bring the uh, the Omaha. I mean, even if you don't survive, if you get hits on higher tier ships, you'll get even more points for that. So, yeah. this stay. Just don't go. You know, it's in. Funny how just he's not mentioning him. that the the one shell from a tier six battleship could just end your ass. <laughs> Well, yeah, I mean, but it could it could in my ass too. I mean, you gotta you gotta stay a little farther out, be kiting. I mean, if you're gonna play a cruiser, I mean, that's just the fucking way of life there. I mean, equipment. Uh... A couple more people, like seven people total in the clan. We could start running those operations back to back. Yeah. Uh, I, was t I was thinking um, I was gonna tell you that um, I was thinking about signing us up for a King of the Hill event. It's uh, oh, 2v2s, yeah. Uh, tomorrow night, I think they're running them, actually. Oh, God, that's what I get for bringing Stu in. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what kind of reward there is, but it sounds like fucking fun. I don't know. I, I never did it. We could give it a shot. I don't care. How am I the only one that's readied up? Putting flags uh, on. Because I'm over here talking, not paying attention. All right, here we go. Funny thing is, I picked the lender. I just forgot to ready it. Did I set this fucking thing up? Mm, God, that's going to be... It's going to hurt. I think we'll be okay. We'll be okay. It's all going to be okay. All right, here we go. So I'm actually thinking that that carousel is not 100% yet, Stu. So we might still have the uh, quick sorting. Okay. I'm, uh, There's too much of it that is not working right now. I haven't updated the uh, mod station, so whatever for now. I haven't had any drop frames playing this game. I had a few uh, in Star Trek when we were playing some of the fucking science shit. Or not the science stuff, the Iconians. It's full of all that. It's like a big fucking rave up in that bitch. Where they're assaulting the the rave sphere. sphere. Do, 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 do. 
Only another like 20 battles to go and I'll have rank battles which I will never probably touch. No, you will touch them. Good. You can get all kinds of badass fucking, well not badass, but you can get way better rewards. Like, when I go in and do a ranked win or lose, like I get fuckloads of uh, XP and stuff. And they're, so they're a lot of fun. advertising that other one? Which one? The one that I went and told, sold, showed you the picture of. Is that ready yet or? Um, I don't know what you're talking about. Your website. Oh, I, I already put it out there as a coming soon. I need to put a few more things on it. I was going to just make a URL that was a redirect, but I mean, I'm not streaming on YouTube, so it didn't really make sense. Like if I streamed on YouTube and on Twitch, then it makes sense. So you can just use that URL and it just auto direct you to wherever you're going. So I decided to make it more of like a directory. So like you could use that to find where I may be streaming, social media, uh, YouTube, that kind of shit. But I have to figure out, I don't know what's the, the coding I used. I used um, iframe uh, HTML for uh, the embedding of the Twitch streams, but it's not working and it's not on fucking my end. Cause if you click on it, it'll take you right to my page. It's just the embedding protocol from Twitch. And I was doing a bunch of reading online. I'm not the only one having that problem. So I might have to try like the JavaScript version or something like that instead. I don't have a problem. It's probably on Twitch's end. They probably got it turned off or the ability to do it. Yeah, or they might have, it might be something where they have to like verify my site or something first, which that might take a little while. Cause I didn't do some of the other security shit that I would probably normally do, but. I feel like I'm in a really shitty position right oh, now. Oh, we're in random, aren't we? Get... Oh yeah, we are. We need to, we need to get the fuck back. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm further back than you are. Yeah, run, I'm, I'm run, running away. Run, well, I'm, unde I'm undetected, run, so. Run! But I'm the furthest. Oh, no, all our team's on that the other side of the map. 8k on that. Play the island over in uh, F2. I'm gonna go hide behind that. F2? Yeah. Oh, the opposite side. 2 F2. No, two you guys is left. Yep. Oh, got a fire. So I see um, there, I already saw their destroyer and he's nowhere near the side, so. I'm running the gauntlet right now. Yeah, get behind that island. Well, I'm getting your waist too, so watch out. Oh, I see you, I see you, okay. I was uh, looking through. at Lurch. <laughs> Where the fuck did all our battleships going? Okay, they all went up the middle. Over here, I'm literally gonna go yeah, I'm gonna have issues over here. I got two. Yeah, battles. if I were you, I would roll out of there. Like, so hang hard left, roll out, and head back towards the battleship. Me and Nick, we'll have to hold up here. Yeah, <clears> you're just you're you're way out by yourself. I got too many ships so within my detection battles. circle. Look, uh, Try and use that island for cover as much as you can. That's what we get for chit chatting, people. Yeah. I'm, I'm like, where I, I go, we got to, one of our battleships is really moving up, so I'm yeah, move up with him. And... Problem is, they're all moving up the middle, so we're just getting fucking flanked like crazy. Uh, if we the Arizona is attracting quite a bit of attention over here, though, so. Actually. Keep on going there, Mr. Uh, Cruiser. I got some presents for you. Hi. He should be coming in the range of the torpedoes. If he stays on course, he's gonna get hit. Never mind, somebody else took him out. Holy fuck. So wasted those for no reason. Yay. That's the Arizona. Well, we got three Flapped him. Two DDs and me, all, all on this side of the map. Like, F6. Yeah, but unfortunately, I think that West Virginia over there knows I'm here now. I think he saw the torps. He's turning now. Well, maybe he'll think it's a DD or... Either way, you could, you should be able to hold him off with that. Fucking island. Come on. So long to back up. It's cray cray. Back the fuck up. There we go. 
<clears throat> see if I can burn this guy down some. He should be coming in my torp range as well. Pop some smoke. Why am I detected? What? Mexico? The fuck uh, is happening? Uh oh. I'm dead. Uh oh. Uh oh. About to get fucked right here. In a bad way. I hate to say this, but I'm having a hard time deciding which fucking side of my ship is the front. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Jesus Christ. We just stop the goddamn ship. That's what I wanna oh, that's what I want to happen. Stop the anchor! <laughs> Alright, there's the conning tower. Jesus Christ. It'd be like the movie Battleship. Except your ship will actually tear apart, which it should have done. <laughs> yeah. Actually, it'll probably snap the damn chain. Right. Where know. is where's like that West Virginia at? Uh, he's over on E two right now. He should be coming around the bend. <clears throat> e two. Okay. Let's see if I can get him spotted here. How, why am uh, I? How Mexico, am I detected? Right yeah, I see his. Mexico. I see him. My range is only 13k, and he's like at 13 too. Here's West Virginia. Yep. I'm getting focused. Yep, got a good hit down. One thing I. I do seem to be consistent with every side I decide to go to seems to be the majority of the team on the enemy side so <laughs> I mean we only got what six seven ships over here originally yep if I can get back behind this goddamn island or damn I'm getting good hit down good hits down on that coding. I'm dead yeah almost I might get some torp hits on this guy All misses. I'm um, gonna get one, maybe. Whoop. One hit. Poop! Alright, Nick, it's all up to you, dude. You got this. Really? Get in that cap. Now, there's two battleships, so, I mean, basically, we were the fodder to slow them down on our weak flank. Well, I just hugged with our battleships and. One I'm about to rim. So we still got two battleships in our cap. They're doing pretty decent on health. I took oh. that last one down pretty far. The other two, eh. If you guys can get rid of, you got rid of that destroyer. If you guys get in their cap, then we've we've won. Especially nice. if, uh, especially if a DD gets in there that's not detectable by that battleship outside the cap. Just if any, now. yeah, and try and avoid if possible being spotted by the. Uh, that uh battleship so if you can be up against like the six seven line in e or in c six seven line of c just in their cap basically hit like on the angle i'm on right now the yeah. circle but the opposite end that the battleship's on them if that if that puts you outside the detection range then that would probably be best case scenario there are three <laughs> battleships still have to deal with our two down there so they're gonna take a little longer that dd that's getting up in there if those two dds get in there though i if you think if you look at your detection range if you're gonna be detected by the battleship don't go in there because if he hits you it resets the cap right well it it does to the points that you accumulate it towards that capture in other words it won't interfere with the destroyer capping it'll only keep resetting i don't your know if i want to be detected by the battleship so if you look at your uh, your mini map, it'll show you a couple yep. different rings. The dotted line, so you have two rings. 
three if, three if you have torps but one of those your outer ring is your firing range the next one in is normally going to be your uh detection do you have torpedoes no I okay use. you do uh, i think it's the dotted one i don't i'm dead so i can't yeah, see mine but the, yeah the dotted so line is your, your detection range down. yeah i'm just I'm, I'm i'm in cap point but i think i'm in his range oh i'm like just on it like yeah i just hit it yeah. But I think he's got... Nope, yeah, he's, he's going for me. Yeah. Regardless what the destroyers say about you resetting their cap, you're not. You're only resetting your cap. It's impossible for that Congo to reset the cap of the destroyers unless he hits the destroyers. So okay, go go be able to stop firing now. Nick, go uh, hard right. Get behind that smoke in that island. The, the way that that uh, Congo is positioned, it, the island will block you, and you have that smoke as well in between, so it'll act like a screen. I've only got 6,600 6, damage. That's okay. Getting a cap too. So, so, I mean, you can do low damage, and if you're spotting, getting caps, getting cap resets if the enemy's in a cap, um, you, can, you can score very well without getting lots of damage. Yeah, the destroyer wants to take first without doing no damage. Yep. All I did was spot out the enemy team. Yep. Uh, don't go too much farther. You're going to be exposed again. Yeah, just stop your ship. You've won in just a couple seconds. I told no, you you had. Push. I told you you had this, Nick. Mm. Boom, oh. boom. I did die. <laughs> I, I think that might have been one of the first randoms I I didn't die in. No, you you did good, man. Uh, you probably scored better than both of us. I mean, I scored fucking oh. last. Lurch did better, so. Yeah. That was that was garbage for me. Second last though. <laughs> Not last. Uh, I, didn't, I just didn't get any hits down. How uh, how much XP and free XP did you get in money? 2,416. How the fuck did you do that? Flags and premium ship. Well, I don't know. that. The, does the premium ship make a difference by itself, or does the premium ship's camo make the difference? The camo on the ship. Okay, because I didn't oh, use I didn't, I didn't use the linked. stock camo, so everything's linked to the camo system. Gotcha. Okay, so the fact that it's premium doesn't make any difference in because I used a different I used a different camo. So what makes the premium ship the premium as far as experience and credits is the camo it comes with. Gotcha. Because the pretty much I mean all the other camos that get dropped from missions and stuff are better than any of those fucking camos. If that's all you got, then definitely want to use them, but. Do, 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 do. Nick, you won us the battle. Congratulations. I did Finally a win. Is that even a sound here? We got so one, on going two, to Disneyland three. Now? Yep. Still a bad night. Well, <laughs> this Saturday isn't too bad of a night. I have nights where it's like all defeats. I think it was like four days, five days ago. I had like all victories except for like two. It was a really good night. Sometimes you just have a bad night on your own. Most of it, though, is dependent on your overall team. Oh, gee, thanks. Not my immediate team, my extended team. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, Lurch and Nick, I'll be back with you in just a moment. All right. I think that is going to do it for me, guys. I appreciate everybody hanging out. I am going to find somebody to raid here on our COGS team. If I can remember how to do that right now, I can. I hope everybody had a good time. Let's see here, who do we want to raid? I'm going to raid somebody that's doing warships. Preferably somebody that doesn't have very many viewers. Well, I mean, I don't have tons, but there's quite a few on the team that have like one and two.
right. Let's go with this guy. He's got a cam, so I'm assuming he has a mic. Um, I may be on tomorrow for SDO. Um, definitely will be on a few times uh, next week, Tuesday and after for SDO. Probably not um, Tuesday, because that's going to be probably a busy night for the category in general, because there's a shitload of new content coming out. Um, so I'll be mainly kind of figuring out what's happening there so I can showcase it as best as possible. But I encourage you to stop by. I will put um, notifications out on Twitter and Discord and Facebook. Um, I'll be rolling out a URL for myself as well. It'll be a um, kind of a directory where to find me, where latest videos are, clan invites, any of those kinds of things. Um, hopefully, hopefully by the beginning of next week, I'll have that together. It's up and live right now, but um, I'm having some problems with the Twitch plugin and shit, but I'll, uh, I'll throw it in if anyone's interested in checking it out. It is mcstew. Did I do live? Yeah, I did live. mcstew.live. Check that out if you're interested. Uh, let's go ahead and get this raid going. I encourage you to stick around, say what's up, give a follow. Let's switch over to my large view. I've been working on this this scene for a little while. Yeah, I think I got it together pretty good. Looks pretty nice, I think. I really need to move my camera, I think, to... Oops, sorry about that. To where my chat and my shit is. So when I'm talking to people and responding to them, it's like I'm looking at them. I need to work on that. Anyways, Orky, thank you for stopping in. Everybody else that was lurking, I appreciate that as well. God damn it. I fucked up the raid. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. All right. All right. We are starting the raid. Five seconds. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Everyone have a good night. Stay safe. Love you.